welcome to the channel in this week's video i'm going to show you my new water set out van life is all about living efficient out on the road the easiest possible ways to do things is what we're always in search for so in this week's video i changed how i fill my water tanks and i'm going to show you guys exactly what i did i have to think outside the box, be efficient, and I've come up with a way where I can fill my tanks with a hose or I can fill them to gravity just pouring water from a grocery store into the tanks if I don't have access to a hose. Now if you remember, if you saw my tour, I do have an external setup. I've got a little door, I open that up, and it's got an access to fill my water tanks. I've had a few issues with that recently with pressure. I've got a pressure regulator through a filter, but it's not 100%. So I'm concerned that at times, if I don't have full control over that pressure, that some water is leaking, and I don't want that water that's leaking to get inside my van. So I've come up with another system um, to use as an alternative if I've got too much pressure or if I feel like it's just an easier system. I open up the back door, which I have to get into the back door anyway to get to my water filter and stuff So and to see the level. So anyway, I'm going to walk you through exactly how I have this set up. Let's go take a look. Okay, so as crazy as it looks, my water tank is in the back. And what I had done was I got this hose and I already had an air hole in the top of my tank. I put this through that hole and I literally just put a funnel on there so that I could dump some individual gallons of water. And you can see that is definitely not a permanent fixture. And I want to get rid of this and make something permanent, something that's going to hold up. So I got to get to that first. And you can see I went to the hardware store and got a ton of I think I got everything that I need that's to secure it I have to get a bigger drill bit and all my adapters so I think it's gonna work out perfect All right, so now I'm going to put this, it's got th a threaded end. I'm going to put that on the end of this flexible adapter. This thing is flexible, it'll bend. That's what I want. Just like that. Just like that. And then this will go just like that. 
let's take a look at how I have everything set up. Inside here, I drilled a three quarter inch hole, put a 10 inch piece of PVC down there, an elbow, just a short splitter, another elbow. I ran that up the side of the van so it's out of the way, secured it to the side right here. This adapter is universal, and that's where everything comes into play. I've got two adapters. I've got this one, and I've got this one. So depending on how I'm going to fill this, if I want to fill it with a hose, that goes in. And then this little elbow goes in. And that hooks up to a water hose. So... I put my filter on here, take that up a little bit, I put my filter on here, connect that to a water hose, and I can fill up my tank, gravity here, through this hose. But, if I don't have access to a water hose, I don't have access to like city water or a well, and I'm just buying some gallons of water and I want to pour it in, that's where this comes into play. This, same size fitting screws in there if I can do this with one hand that screws in nice little just gravity see how it's got a nice slope to it just gravity and this is the funnel that I bought for my other setup I went ahead and just trimmed it that goes in there and now let me see if I can put that in there a little bit better that goes in there and then I just take my gallons of water and pour them, pour my gallons of water into here and gravity, it takes it all the way down. So whether or not I have access to a hose or just have access to gallons of water, I can fill up my tank. Maybe not fill it up, but definitely get it to the point where I can take a shower, I can do my dishes and whether I've got this one on here or this adapter, either one, the door still closes. Just close that right up and it does not hit. So, I already, I, I put a little bit of water in there last night just to test it out. I'm already super happy with that setup. Quick and easy, just a few adapters and I'm set. Alright, so there's another DIY project done. I'm always finding new ways to improve things, to make things easier and more efficient while I'm out here living van life. I love to share these improvements with you guys to give you guys ideas. I love watching your videos, learning ideas. So, quick and easy change, a quick trip to Home Depot and not even an hour's worth of work and all done so all right so we got to fill these tanks up and do some fishing we'll see you guys on the next video